ever wondered how to easily upload a PDF to ChatGPT, stick around and I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step process how to unlock the true potential of ChatGPT with PDF uploads. First things first, ensure you're using ChatGPT4 and have the plugins enabled. Let me show you how to do that. If you don't have ChatGPT4, you can click on those three buttons here and then click on upgrade. I already do have that, so I don't see that option. But once you do, you click on settings and beta, and then you have to click again on beta features over here, and then you have to slide this button to the right. That's how you activate plugins in the first place. But that's not all. Now you might be wondering which plugin do I need and how do I install it? By the way, in the description you will find a link with the PDF that has all the steps that I'm just talking you through and you can follow along. If you click up here on ChatGPT4 in a new chat, now you see different versions of ChatGPT4. You need to click on the one that has plugins enabled, this one. Then you see this little text appearing here, no plugins enabled. And if you click on the drop down here, and then scroll down. I have to scroll down. You probably don't have to scroll down because uh, you don't have any apps installed yet. You click here on Plugin Store. And then AI PDF will probably be one of the first ones. If not, you can go in here and search AI PDF. Then you have to click on Install. It takes a few seconds. And then once you have that, you can close the Plugin Store. And now, if you click on the little drop down, you will see AI PDF here and you have to do a check mark next to AI PDF. Now, remember, if you start a new chat and you start typing, then it's too late to add any more plugins in. So you have to activate the plugins before you start chatting. This is always important. I always keep um, AI PDF and a web plugin installed when I use it so that if I use it later on, I can do that and don't have to copy everything into a new chat. Now you might be wondering where to upload your PDF. There's no direct upload button, so we have to take an extra step, but it's super easy and I'll show you next how to do this. You simply go into a browser and type in aipdf.app and then it says sign up for free and upload in AI Drive. Do that and then just sign in, it's free. And what this is, is essentially a cloud space where you can store PDFs. This step seems unnecessary, but the point is to create a URL that ChatGPT can read as I'll show you next. And this free service fits the bill. Okay, so we have signed up and then I click here on this little icon up here. This is actually a button. It doesn't look like it, it looks like a logo, but it's a button. And if you click on here and click on file upload, then you can upload a PDF and click on upload. And then you have it here in your AI drive. The cool thing is only you have access to that and no one else. And so now I want this link and click simply on the link symbol, copy this one over here. Back to ChatGPT we go. Simply paste the link in and ask ChatGPT to summarize the PDF for you. Summarizing the info in the PDF is the obvious choice and that's what I do first too. But in a sec, I'm going to tell you a different use for this that unlocks tons of ChatGPT potential. Okay, you see it's already accessing the PDF plugin. Uh, use PDF and then it says the provided PDF titled EU Insight Study on Consumer and Dietary Sugars is like a 40 page um, medical journal and it gives me a really nice summary here and you can this is obvious you can use this for research you can use this with books you can use this with your own articles or your own material that you want to upload and reference and get summaries in. and you can actually ask questions about the pdf and everything so this is super super useful and i'm not going to let this um, continue now I'm going to stop this. A second use case and it's super cool is using a PDF to load detailed instructions like a brand voice, for example, in a 15 page document. And you can do that. And instead of priming a chat with all different informations, you can simply load in a predefined PDF with all the information you need about your business and have it ready to go and even have a specific process that it will take you through. And I'm going to quickly show you how that looks like. I'm in a new chat. And I just said, read this um, PDF and don't give me a summary. Don't tell me what's inside. Just follow who it asks you to be and what it tells you to do, please. Okay, there we have it. Um, choose how many pieces of content. How many articles would you like to generate? Okay, let's say I want to write three articles. Okay, it asks me what are some subjects or themes you're passionate about or interested in exploring. I want to write about use cases of AI in marketing. Fantastic topic, AI in marketing has a plethora of applications and potential. Let's delve deeper. Okay, now it gives me a few options. It says specific AI tools, 
um, that I have in mind or industry sectors or challenges and solutions. And I say, I am thinking about uh, mid journey for image creation, especially Facebook ad images. Okay. Focusing on the mid journey of image creation, especially for Facebook ad images is a niche and a relevant topic. Okay, are there specific? And then it goes on and on and on and it takes me through a process. And if you're interested in how to generate instructions that someone in your team or yourself can follow so you don't have to do it every time all over again, leave a comment and I'll make a video about that too. And this is it. This concludes the video. If you found this guide helpful, wait till you see what's next. Dive deeper into the world of AI with our next video. Don't forget to click and watch.